All right, he's coming around. Everything seems to work so far. He's obviously gonna crash when he gets here, but that's fine. Come on, let's see the crash. Come on, do it, do it, crash. Here it comes, here it comes, and... How's it going everybody? My name is Finpire. We're back, we're playing Train of VR. So in the last video, we made this sort of whole track scene. All right, it actually works. Look at this. Let's just, oh God, oh God, wrong button, wrong button. There we go, look. See, the train actually works. It goes through, we tested this out. It's awesome, okay, it doesn't derail anywhere. So today, I thought we could expand on this, try and build a little bit more of a city, get some buildings, maybe some, we can't really put any like roads down because there's nothing to actually put like roads in, but we could do like, you know, sections between buildings, which would give the feeling of there being roads. So I think that'd be something cool that we could do. I actually left a message on uh, on the Steam forum or Steam discussion for this particular page. It just, it just derailed because the, uh, the little track switch has gone the wrong way. And I, uh, I let them know some of my suggestions and uh, it sounds like they're actually going to implement them, um, which is pretty cool. Oh, hang on. Let's just switch that over. So that needs to go that way. Hang on. Let's just put that like that. Okay. Like some of the things I think that they should add to this game is uh, probably, obviously more decorations. More decorations would be good. Um, the ability to kind of like move yourself around, kind of like how you do in Tiny Town, in that way you can like grab the air, because it's a little bit more accurate than kind of teleporting everywhere. Um, you kind of, because sometimes when you teleport, you don't exactly know where you're going to end up. Uh, getting rid of this menu would be good, because uh, this menu kind of like hangs around all the time, uh, even when you're trying to simulate the actual, you know, the train track, it's always there, uh, which kind of gets a little bit annoying. But if you have any more suggestions, let me know in the comments below, uh, because the developer actually watched my last video. So if you leave some comments, there's a good chance that they'll actually see your suggestions, and then we can get them into this game, and make this game even more awesome. Okay, so there's something else that I wanted to try today, and that is... A bit of a jump. <laughs> Obviously the train's not gonna get, like, airborne, but I wonder if it can, like, drop off and kind of, like, land back on a track and keep going. That's- that is something that seems like it might be possible. Hang on. Let's just- can we just move this track? There we go, let's just snap that in place. I just noticed it was red. I don't know why. There we go. Oh. I think that snapped. Okay, I don't think we have to worry about that. Let's first, though, get some- how do I- oh, I don't want to save that. No, I don't want to. I don't want to! Let's uh, move this over here, all right, and let's start putting in some buildings and things. Start getting a little bit more of like a town going on. Okay, so I'm gonna get some buildings. Um, maybe like, so like this way. Maybe one like here. Or more. We can change the color of these afterwards. Oh, oh. It's very easy to drop them. <laughs> all right, so we can go like that. And you can change them, see? Duplicating items would be a good one as well. So you could quickly duplicate them, and you could possibly even get them lined up. I know they've, they've kind of tried to go for this whole, um, like, you know, you're playing in your bedroom on the floor with, like, actual pieces, and they feel very, like, you know, tangible pieces that you can throw around, like actual toys and blocks and that kind of thing. Um, but having the ability to do, like, you know, like, full-scale city building, like, really quickly, I think would be fun. Okay, so I'm just- I'm just trying to build some streets. Okay, this is looking pretty good. I've already put some, uh, some houses and stuff like that in, so I might put some cars in. Maybe, like, a couple of vans or something like that. There we go. Just a couple of worker vans driving around. Okay, how's that looking? I think we've got, like, a bit of a town sort of going on. Uh, move this menu out of the way for the minute. Oh, no, just- just over there, menu. You stay right there, champ, until I need you again. Hey, that looks good. Yeah, I'm happy with this. Can you actually stack these? No. Can you stack these buildings? Um. Oh, you can! You can almost make, like, skyscrapers with them. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay. Awesome. Oh, look at that. We've got, like, a big building in the middle. That looks good. i put these trees just here like this. Maybe even just out the front. Okay, so what we can do... Oh, why'd I throw that away? Oh, damn it. Okay, hang on, just pick that up. Put that in there for a minute. Okay, so we might put another station. Um, oh, there's a station already there, which is sort of quite close already. I don't think we need another station. I 
put some more houses around though. Hey, street lights are a good way to uh, to sort of simulate there being a road, I think. Oh, 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 what? What did I just do? <laughs> oh, th I just changed the time of day by flicking on the street lights. Oh my god, I didn't know that was a thing. Did not know that was a thing. All right, let's go over here, put more of these in. Oh, uh, th this just changed the whole game. Okay, let's put them there as well. Street lights everywhere. This is this is something. This is something. Okay, let's have a look what that looks like at night time. Ooh. Doesn't that look good? Oh, wow. It just adds this whole new look to the game. Oh, I really like that. Okay, let's get to building some more track. The part that this game's actually all about. Alright, we just gotta make it daytime again. What, can we, what does this thing do? I've got no idea what this does. Hang on. Is it... Can you do something with this? No, you just pick it up. Okay. It Maybe it has some sort of functionality. I'm not 100% sure. Um, so we've got the garage pieces. The randomizer. We've got a crane. What? Maybe there's something we can do with the crane. Okay, well let's go over here and let's start building. Okay. So I want to sort of build it out this way a little bit. I'm getting a little bit lost in myself. Hang on. Alright. Here we go. Here's a good spot. Let's put our menu here. And alrighty, so let's get some tracks in, put a curve in to sort of start Or well, maybe a bit of a straight piece and then a curve just so it's not so all of a sudden There we go Yes, okay, cool um, So you can kind of change whether it goes around back to the town or whether it sort of veers off this way Okay, I'm gonna put in another station. All right Just gonna put one there and I'm also gonna put in like a garage um, so if we come over this way, we're gonna put in another uh, split piece. Okay, so I've built this bit here, right? So we've got a bit of a station where things can be like let off and you know people obviously can like get off at the station and, and what have you. And then they can get the trains can come through here, right? We've got two garage bays where the trains can be worked on or they can be stored away. We've got like a crane section here, so we can basically just like we can go like this and we can switch that over so the train comes through, it stops at the crane. I, I don't know what what happens at the crane. I haven't tested that out yet. <laughs> but then they all join back up again. So once the train's gone through and it's done its bit, it just joins back up. Alright. Let's keep building. This is looking really good already. I'm happy with the way this is. Look at it. Look at it. That's a solid looking little tiny town at the moment. Okay, now I'm gonna build like a bit of a mountain section here. Though, hang on. Maybe we could get something going on with this. Let's try these. Put some tunnels in. Okay. Snap some tunnels together. Then I want it to kind of like loop back around. So it comes over this way, goes on top of this. Just building some scaffolding going over the top here. So we've got like a tunnel, comes up over here. We've got a crossroads going on in the middle. This thing's looking pretty cool. I want to put like a bridge going over there between two tunnels. I thought that'd be a bit of fun. Just need to get some curved sections going on here and hopefully these two bits will join up. Fingers crossed. Okay, I realized I put this piece of track just down with absolutely no reference to the rest of the track. Because if you uh, if you try to do that, you know, try to join up two completely separate pieces of track, there's a good chance that they're not going to join up. You should basically just keep following it through like a snake, and then everything should join up without any worries at all. Which means I need to move all this stuff. So, I need to... I should probably just build from this would be the best way to do it. Okay, this is looking pretty good. Just need to go over here now. Uh, we just need to line these up. Let's get this long piece of track. How's that? Yeah, it looks pretty good. This pillar could be straighter. Cool. Probably not long enough though. Okay, this is looking a little bit better now. So if we go here like this. Of course, now our, uh, our tunnels are a little bit out. The tunnels don't make a great deal of sense anymore. The bridge is like off center, which is super annoying. <laughs> Hang on, we should be able to move this. So if we go, we want that about... Oh, kind of want it about there, to be honest. But there's no like, there's no track pieces that are about that size. What we could potentially do to make this look a little bit better. 
Let's just put that over there for a moment. And maybe join that up there somehow. So get some pillars on this. So if we go... Try not to bash our thing around too much. And go like this. Um, can we join that on there? Come on. Come on, join! Ah, uh, Doesn't want to join very well. Oh, it looks nice though. I wish it did join. Hang on, let's join those two together. Okay. So now, yeah, see now that doesn't fit. <laughs> Damn! Wait a minute. How about... How about we move this back? Okay, could we join anything on there? Maybe these two. Oh, that is so close! So close! Hang on. That fits. Now we just need to slot that down in there nicely. Yeah! Cool! Alright, we got it! Now we just need to work out how to make it go over this bit. Okay, we can do this. Let's get these. Okay, we're definitely gonna need that. Okay, we need another one on this side, like this. I'm guessing. And then probably like some kind of... Maybe like a piece like that. That's probably too long. Okay, come on, join! Almost. Oh. Jeez. <laughs> Does not want to join. I'm not comfortable with that. That is not accurate. Okay, how's this looking? Ooh, that looks nice. Yeah, I'm happy with that. That is so cool. Is that? Is that lined up? Eh, it's lined up all right. Okay, well let's do a bit of a loop, okay, and see if we can actually get this thing going around. See if this w thing works. Um, so we'll go straight through here, straight through there, and that should be good. Okay, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put this above my head, um, so that it doesn't get in the way. Okay, everything should be good to go. Go train! Here we go. Train's going round. There's a bit of a gap. How'd the gap get there? Eh, it's fine. The train doesn't seem to care. All right, it's going through. Nice, nice. This is good. It's going around through the tunnel. Hasn't derailed yet. It's pretty decent. We don't want it to come back through this way, so we need to switch that over. All right, it's coming around the little loopy bit. Oh, go train. This train's the best. <laughs> All right, it's coming down here. It's gonna come down the hill. I like this tunnel. This is a cool looking tunnel. Whoa. All right, it's going through the tunnel, and it's going that way. It's gonna come through the station. We could put a stop at this station, somehow. All right, here he goes, through the tunnel. Oh, nice one, dude. Jeez, that's a tight tunnel. You could probably stack these tunnels as well. That'd be a bit of fun. All right, it's coming around. Everything seems to work so far. He's obviously gonna crash when he gets here, but that's fine. Come on. Let's see the crash. Come on, do it. Do it, crash. Here it comes, here it comes. And... Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, that was good. It wasn't as dramatic as what I thought it would be, but it was still good nonetheless. What happens now if we were to put... Um, hang on, just put this, like, here. Maybe just move all these back a little bit. Put all the little track pieces and all the little... Uh, all the little bits of train. We'll put that train there like this. Okay, what would happen, right, if we were to get some track? Um, we to go like this. Uh, or even, even go like this. Will the train jump? Is that lined up? I need to make sure it's straight. Okay, that's straight. Can it do a jump? Here we go. Here we go. Huh. Oh, wow! It worked, but it left its cargo behind. Oh, that's no good. Can you put, like, two trains, like, back to back, so that one can pull and one can push? Like, if they want to go the other way. Um, oh, yeah, that's not gonna work. Let's put that there like that. Put that train in, okay, so that they join up. Let's go back to here. We'll get this little guy. 
Oh god, where'd he go? Oh, he's in there! Get out of there! Alright, and we'll put that there. So if we go... Oh, he does go back the other way! Hey, come back, come back! Okay, so let's... Here we go! He's gonna do a jump again! Will he keep going? No, he just stops, and that guy just keeps going. He's like, alright, cool! I'm done. I'm gonna take it now. <laughs> that is pretty cool, though! Oh, and you could also make the track go through this way if you wanted to. Hmm, very interesting. So, they kind of do a jump, but then they stop. Uh, what about the freight? What does the freight do? Let's get that... Let's put this on the back here. Um, hang on. Uh, wait a minute. Let's put that on there, right? And let's send the train back the other way. And then we'll see if we can stop it at the freight thing. So, we need to switch that to there. Uh, that should work. Train's gonna go around. Get that out of the way. This train's just hanging out here. He's like, ah, I don't care anymore. I don't care. I'm done. I did my jump. I did my stunt for the day. Alright, here comes the train. It's coming out. And will he stop? No. Is this thing just completely for show? I think it's for show. Okay, alright. Well, the train's heading back the other way now. He's gonna go have fun over there. Okay, so I thought over in this bit we could add like another town or something like that. Um, I'm not too sure. We could add like a bit of a bridge. I thought maybe we could try and raise all this section up and have a bridge so that the cars could drive completely all the way through um, and have like a little bit more train track coming down this way. We'll see how we go. But if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments below. But thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked it, give us one of these ones and I'll see you guys next time.